What it do, what it do, what it do, Half and J family. Welcome back to the channel, baby. Yes. It's your boy, Half. And your girl, J. And we back with, with another, another reaction, reaction video. video. You feel me? I feel you. All right, so look, y'all. Today's video is sponsored by fancustom.com. Mm -hmm. It's a really cool site, y'all. Y'all can go in there, check some things out. You can get some custom jerseys made. I'm talking about anything from football, basketball, hockey. Let me show y'all what I'm talking about, man. You got football, basketball, hockey, hoodies, shorts, golf hats, pants. I mean, you pretty much name it, they got it on here, man. And the prices are very, very reasonable, too, by the way. You know what I'm saying? So, with the, it's baseball season. Y'all might well go copy all some baseball jerseys, right? You yeah. feel me? You know, custom made, like we have here on the logo. You know what I mean? Got the good vibes in the front. Let me show y'all real quick so y'all can get a full understanding of what's going on over here. <laughs> you did. Yes, sir, you see it. Bam. <laughs> back right here, though, with the half with the back. You feel me? Stop playing with the kid, though. Yes, sir. Okay, I have on the jersey, the baseball jersey. Bam. And with the J on the back, bam, the 05. Right. With the good vibes, good on, vibes the front. on the front. Number boom. 23. Boom, boom, boom. You feel me? So, again, fancustom.com right here. And when you get to the checkout, you want to put in half and J. And you'll get 10% off. 10%? Off. Shh. Don't tell nobody we told y'all that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We definitely appreciate you guys, man. Yes, we do. If you guys get one, take a picture, we're gonna post you guys. Alright? Yes. Alright, man. We have to stay. Yes. Peace. Peace. What it do, what it do, what it do. Welcome back to the channel, baby. Yeah. Alright, y'all. So welcome back to the chit 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 channel. Mm. You know what welcome I'm saying? Back, <laughs> <laughs> welcome back, y'all. Welcome back. Right. So, I um, hope you guys got a chance to see our little other reaction that we threw out there. Mm -hmm. Really good reaction, by the way. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, we're on this journey. We hope that you guys are coming along with us. And for the ones who's jumping ship, we will throw you a life jacket. Oh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, with that being said, baby, let us know who we're going to react to today. We are reacting to, again, <coughs> Fox News. Shout out, Fox News. Shout out. Shout out, Jesse Waters. Jesse Waters. We love your show. You the truth, baby. Uh, and it's titled, Biden Lost Control. Lost Control. Now, we're not quite sure if we're talking about lost control, like going, Aah! you know, me going crazy, like Martin did way back in the day. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> or, did he just lose control as far as being in charge? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. But anyway, man, let's jump right into it, man. But before we do, everybody else out there who has not yet subscribed to that shit, man, bam, go ahead and subscribe button. Yes. Turn your post notifications on. Yes. Like and share this video. Yes. And comment down below, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Come and join the squad, man. Yes. <laughs> Half and J. Yeah. Plus, we already kicking kick off. Up. What? Good vibes, baby. baby. Good vibes. Boom. Boom. Y'all like that? Fanscustom.com. Ten percent off. Use promo code Half and J. Y'all can get y'all one custom made, however y'all want it. Right. Yes, sir. Links will be down in the description below. Yes. Let's get it. Life has a way of hitting you when you least expect it, and when it happens, you gotta play cool. A girl tells you it's over. Thank her. You can do better. <laughs> Teacher calls on you in class. Be strong and wrong. <laughs> When you get called up onto the stage, act like you've been there before. Be yeah, oh, no. I'm gonna take a little bitty. Honestly. Come on. Give me a hand. I'm not prepared. I really am not prepared at all. <laughs> yeah. Right. This is a surprise. Right. Not prepared, <laughs> Guys, E Harlem Shakedown, E flat. Keep it simple, splashy, and uh, Jerry, let's take the bass line for a walk. Wait a minute, though. He's not prepared <laughs> stuff, but he came up there like right. he's been there right. before. You feel me? Damn. What's flashy and uh, Jerry? Let's take the baseline for a walk. <laughs> take the baseline for a walk. I don't hear it right. <laughs> but when you're the president of the United States, you have to channel your emotions strategically. You can't just snap out of the blue. And today, that's what Joe Biden did. He lost yeah. control, and the whole country got a taste of his rage. Ooh. President Biden, how involved were you in your son's Chinese shakedown text message? Were you sitting there? This were you involved? Were you involved? No. Were you? Involved? Were you, involved? Were you, were you no. Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> that was a warning shot. <laughs> wow. <laughs> he said, no. 
Like, <laughs> you feel me? Uh, better calm down there, young man. You know what I'm saying? You know, don't let it happen to you. You know, don't want to slip and fall. Ooh. Ooh. Mm -mm. Were you sitting there? This Were you involved? Were you involved? No, Were you? No. Whoa. <laughs> that was a warning hey. shot. The press finally hit a nerve, and Joe Biden just sent a message. Don't you ever ask me that question right. again. This is an important moment in history right now. Yeah. The press cannot buckle. The free press cannot wilt because the commander in chief tries to scare you out of following the facts. Right. Joe Biden, astonishingly, has never been asked direct questions about his family's <coughs> extortion racket. But it's becoming impossible for the press to make it invisible. Right. New text messages released by the IRS whistleblowers continue to chip away at Biden's armor of denial. In a message to Mr. Dong, not kidding. Hunter says, quote, I'm tired of this. I can make five million in salary from any law firm in America. If you think it's about money, it's not. The Bidens are the best at doing exactly what the chairman wants from this partnership. Ooh. Please, let's not quibble over peanuts. Ooh. Wow. Y'all. Damn. Law people make that much money? Hey, we in the wrong business. But he says the Bidens are the best at doing exactly, exactly what the shit. what Chairman wants from this from this partnership. Wow. Wow. Please let's let's not quibble over peanuts. And right, five million dollars is peanuts. <whistles> and you know it just mm -hmm. makes me think also like. For them to blow the whistle, what was going on though? Like, how did they rub that person the wrong way to where they feel like they had to blow, blow the whistle? Like, what was they getting? You know what I'm saying? Like, they they, they had to be getting something, receiving something, and to be mad and to where they're like, okay, I'm about to tell now. Right. You know what I'm saying? Y'all cut me off. Oh, I'm about to tell now. You know what I'm saying? Like, whoo, this was back in 2017. Boy, what? That was app. That's why I don't download it. No, it's playing. <laughs> <laughs> if you think it's about money, it's not. The Bidens are the best at doing exactly what the chairman wants from this partnership. Please, let's not quibble over peanuts. Wow. To the Bidens, $5 million from China's peanuts kind of makes you wonder about the money that we haven't found out about right. yet. Right. This racket could be as large as 50 mil when we're done. Man. So, the Bidens wanted 10 million from the Chinese communist spies. And they'd do anything for it. I mean, anything. Hmm. But the wires... They got to clear by tomorrow or else the big guy's angry. Quote, I will make certain that between the man sitting next to me and every person he knows and my ability to forever hold a grudge that you will regret not following my direction. I am sitting here waiting for the call with my father. Ooh. The president's son was threatening Chinese spies to wire cash. Think about that. And think about what the cash was for. Hunter doesn't run a business, it was a bribe. Mm. The Bidens were shaking down foreign scoundrels for bribes, and they were good at it. Data mafia? I'm speechless, yeah. Data mafia. Right. It's like, you gotta pay taxes, homie. Ooh. You feel me? <laughs> wow, now that's the MOB. Wow. That is crazy right there. Mm -hmm. And these are quotes, though. Right. That's in black and white. Right. Right. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like that says, Biden's to China, give me money or else. Where are the protesters for this, though? Right. <laughs> Whoa. Remember when Tr Trump went to his indictment and that guy in the jail suit, he was protesting and ran in front of the... Yeah. Where, where, where are you at? Right, <laughs> where right, are you at? Right, right, right. This is crazy right here, though. The Bidens were shaking down foreign scoundrels for bribes, mm -hmm. and they were good at it. Most people have no clue that in 2023, wow. the best way to make money on Amazon is not with physical products. Hunter claimed his dad was sitting beside him was the fact that just days after he sent the message, a $5 million wire 
right. transferred. Right. So there was money there, and that's ha- days after. Mm-hmm. All of a sudden, coincidentally, five million dollars get wired. Yeah. yeah. That is yeah. crazy, boy. <laughs> and here I am getting a ticket for some weed. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, whoa. <laughs> Which way are we going? <laughs> Sitting beside him was the fact that just <coughs> days after he sent the message, a five million dollar wire right. transferred. Right. So there was money there, and that's how the Bidens operate. Usually, Joe Biden set up a meeting and has been a part of a meeting prior to any money changing hands, mm-hmm. and then usually Hunter would have to squeeze these foreign nationals to get to, the money. To get the money. Joe Biden was setting up meetings and Joe Biden was in meetings and Joe Biden delivered. That's when Hunter would demand payment. The cracked out bag man for the VP. This kickback scheme was so blatant that the entire federal government knew about it. Mm. It went down right under Barack Obama's nose. It could have taken down his presidency because let's be honest, Obama was briefed on it. Had to have been briefed. Maybe that's why he told Biden not to run. Maybe that's why he warned us Biden was going to muck it up because he knew. But as long as Biden was someone's number two, he was untouchable. And now that he's number one, the protection policy continues. Right. Even before President Biden took office, he was directed to avoid leads involving Hunter's father. There were certain investigative steps that we weren't allowed to take that could have led us to President Biden. And you wanted to take them? We needed to take them. And you weren't allowed to take them? That's correct. So they make up leads with Trump and then avoid leads with Biden. Wow. Rewind that part one more time. Wow. Leads involving Hunter's father. There were certain investigative steps that we weren't allowed to take that could have led us to President Biden. And you wanted to take them. We needed to take them. And you weren't allowed to take them. That's correct. So they make up Lee. Can y'all hear that? I mean, did, did y'all hear that? They was not allowed to take the leads, though. Right. If that's not corrupt, then what the hell it is? Right. I'm not talking about corrupt from the dog pound. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> we needed to take them, and you weren't allowed to take them. That's correct. So they make up leads with Trump and then avoid leads with Biden. Hmm. And the New York Times today verified that Biden's Justice Department obstructed justice in the Hunter Biden investigation. Biden was never supposed to be crooked. That was crooked's job. Joe was supposed to be the honest Amtrak commuter from Scranton. Right. Now, if America found out middle-class Joe wasn't really the poorest member of Congress all these years, (laughs) that punctures the biggest myth in Washington. If Joe Biden's a phony, Everybody else is a phony. Right. If Washington, D.C. could push that lie for decades, what else are they lying about? Right. Plus, Joe lost his wife in a car accident and his son to cancer and his other son's a drug addict. People feel sorry for Joe, and they right. should for that. So they're thinking, do we really need to be looking into his finances? Let the guy make a few dirty millions on the side. That's the thinking. But at 80 years old, no one's ever told the man to shape up. So he's going to keep selling you his lunch pail fantasy. Biden now is just another way of saying, restore the American dream. Because it worked before. That's the next phase of this fight. Making the tax code fair for everyone. Making the wealthy and super wealthy and big corporations begin to pay their fair share. As Gutfeld wisely said, you want to know what Bidenomics really is? Bidenomics is demanding foreign bribes and hiding it from the IRS. Right. Might not be the American dream, but it's Biden's dream. Right. And while Joe wants to raise your taxes, his son never paid a dime. Right. Man. And it wasn't just failure to pay, it was fraud. There were personal expenses that were taken as business expenses. Prostitutes, sex club memberships, hotel rooms for purported drug dealers. How much is under Biden on taxes? Wait, wait, wait. So- <laughs> I gotta rewind that. Whoa. I have to rewind this, y'all. You see how much he owed? Wow. $2.2 million? Fraud. There were personal expenses that were taken as business expenses. Prostitutes, 
sex club memberships, hotel rooms for purported drug dealers. How much did Hunter Biden owe in taxes? So from 2014 to 2019, it was $2.2 million. If this was any other person, they likely would have already served their sentence. Right. Facts. If you don't pay your tax. That's facts. I owe them. Not that much, of course, but they was like choking me about mine. Right. You feel me? I got, got me scared, dog. I ain't never owed the IRS in my life. I'm like, damn, what? Wow. I owe y'all. Prostitutes. That's foul. Drug dealers. That's foul. Wow. That's, 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 wow. I guess because I'm just a normal average Joe. You know what I'm saying? Like. Of course, they're protected. And mine's is actually peanuts compared to what this food is. Oh, yeah. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. I'm, I'm pissed off now. For real, for real. If this was any other person, they likely would have already served their sentence. Now, if you don't pay your taxes, one of Biden's 87,000 IRS agents comes knocking at your door right. and they're packing. Oh, yeah. But when the Bidens dodge two mil in taxes, the attorney general just runs out the clock on the statute of limitations. So the tax man never cometh. There's still, you know, outstanding uh, tax due and owing above that six hundred and twenty thousand dollars that because of this this deal, they'll never uh, they'll never recoup. The most substantive uh, uh, felony charges were, were left off the table, mm. which would have been what? Which would have been uh, evasion for 14, false return for 18 and 2019. So Hunter was only charged for his 2018 and 19 tax crimes, but the guy dodged taxes in 2014, 15, 16, and 17. Wow. So why didn't he get slapped with charges for those? Well, the feds looked at the clock and said, oops, too late, can't charge you. And Hunter's been a serial tax cheat his whole life. A former Biden donor told Primetime, Hunter's rap sheet's filled with tax crimes from way back. U.S. Attorney David Weiss has ex some explaining to do with respect to the public of how Hunter, who was a lawyer, by the way, who's a lawyer, who also had his passport revoked by the State Department because of his tax liens in 2015 and 2016, and he's a lawyer and then he is not charged with tax evasion. He's not charged with felonies. He gets misdemeanors for not filing. He had, not, he had tax uh, issues going back to 2009, 2010. He had tax liens put on his homes, on his wife's homes. The Bidens are just a bunch of rapscallions who've been skirting laws their whole lives. But is this about to change? Hunter has an upcoming date in court with Judge Mary Ellen Narica, who's going to be overseeing the case. And she has the power to throw Hunter's sweetheart deal in the trash. She doesn't have to accept this dirty plea, this no prison plea. This investigation's tainted and it has cover up written all over it. So what will the judge do? Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey. Wait, was that a picture of, of Hunter? <laughs> wow. He looked like he'd been on a coke binge with the prostitutes. In that in that photo, right? I'm 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 so I'm so furious right now though. Like right. seriously though, like I didn't know all that. And we voted for this man. Voted for him though. I should slap myself. I gotta. <sighs> when mm. you know better, you do better. That's for darn sure. This fool owed two point two million dollars from fourteen to nineteen. And here I owe some chump change, though. And they all over me. Oh, yeah. Like, all over me. I can show right. y'all just stacks of paperwork. Hell. And I'm pretty sure thousands of other people. Feel the same way I feel. Right. Real talk. Real talk. I mean, they... This stressed out, worried. Super stressed out, though. Where are you going to let me go? But he's skating by, smiling, laughing all, all the way to the bank. All the way to the bank. It's, that's not fair at all. At all, man. That, that's, 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 yeah, that's way foul right there. Like, that's, ooh, that got me hot. I, I'm really mad about that. I'm dead serious, though. I'm super hot about that. In, in his campaign, he is feeding, like he said, people fantasies. He's standing up there and lying. The snake. Right. You know what I'm saying? What Trump 2024. Man, homie. <laughs> Woo! Y'all comment down below, man. Let us know what y'all think about it. If this made you mad, I'm gonna see the mad emojis lit up in the comment section. We're gonna start it off.
Cause this got me super oh, pissed yeah. off right here though, like for real. So if y'all mad like I am, I wanna see mad emojis in the comment section. All I wanna see, mad emojis, homie. Cause I'm pissed off. He deserves to be impeached. Yeah, that's facts. Let's jump to some shout outs. First shout out goes to mm. Jeremy Underhill. What's up, Jeremy Underhill? Jeremy Underhill, what's going on, man? Shout out to you. Hope you definitely enjoyed that reaction. Yeah. Let us know what you thought about it. Comment down below. Come back and join us for some more. Yes. Second shout out goes to Love Bites. What's up, Love Bites? It definitely does. Mm -hmm. Shout out to you. Hope you definitely enjoyed that reaction. Uh, let us know what you thought about it. If you're mad like I am and like Jay is, mad emojis in the comment section. And if you're not already subscribed, subscribe to our channel and Jesse Waters. Yeah. Jesse Waters. Yeah. I'm a huge fan. Yeah. Huge fan. Me too. Mm -hmm. So I'm following the Me Too movement. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> all right, y'all. We love y'all, man. Yes, we do. Peace. Peace.